Okay, so welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. And so now, we're going to warp back into Lion's Arch, and we're going to go and get contacted by an Apple merchant, who will give us our first real assignment. <sighs> Apple merchant, how the heck did they come up with that? Is the Apple merchant going to be my mentor? Hmm... If I'm correct, this is going to be a really easy one, and then we're going to be done with the story. Yay. So. Eternal loading screens are always so much fun. Okay. It's done. And I am have a relatively high amount of lag right now. With a single step. Oh, it's this one. Hmm. This is gonna be, um, I'm gonna listen to this because this is a pretty cool debate. I'm Logan, and I'm gonna run away. Hey, that's not fair. Logan didn't run away, he went to save the queen. That's running away. His guild needed him. Ritlock wouldn't have run away. Why don't you be Ritlock then? Okay, I will. I'm Ritlock Brimstone, harpy sniffing dragon. Feel the wrath of my flaming sword. If he gets to change, I want to change too. I'm Kate now. Then I'm Zoja. Your leadership stinks like a squirt cesspool, Air. You're the reason we failed. You can't be Zoja. You're I could the outrun dragon. a centaur. And I'm not Air anymore. I'm Kate. And Kate says, focus on the dragon, morons. Sure, oh. tribunes don't take orders from Kinlan. Follow me, everybody. Uh, except you, Logan. You can run back to your girlfriend. With that. He didn't run away. Ha! I'm Dragon again. And Destiny's Edge is too busy fighting each other to fight me. Die! That's sa that, that, it's sad out. but true. The dragon got us. Only Logan had run away and Air was better than it. Yeah? Well, if only Ritlock had stuck to the plan and Zoja wasn't so cranky. Mmm. Destiny's Edge tastes delicious. Now, I shall conquer the world! Okay, everybody stop. This isn't working. Let's play Renegades and Separatists instead. Dibs on Ajax. Well, that was an interesting debate. And so now we get to talk to all these guys and see and see how they really feel about each other. Hello, Logan. Welcome, fellow members of Destiny's Edge. We must speak of the threat of the Elder Dragons. When I agreed to come, I didn't know you'd be inviting this char. I could say the same for you, human. Finally crawling back for forgiveness, Logan. I've done nothing that needs to be forgiven. Logan, Ritlock, enough of your squabbling. Kate, I doubt that we can unite again. Not after our last mistake. The Norn's right. When heirs to Galkin makes mistakes, people die. Is that what you think, Soja? That what happened was my fault? Please, all of you. Our time has come. We must help the Orders. We have fought the Elder Dragons before. And lost. Because someone couldn't keep up with us. You have something to say, say it to my face. I would if you weren't always running away. I should gut you and be done with it. Gut me? With what? That human-made sword you looted from Ascalon? I've had enough. We're done here. Running away again. Ritlock, you're just making it worse. Ha! Look who's talking! Logan's right. 
for once. I have more important things to do. I'm done with this. And I refuse to waste my efforts on cowards and fools. Goodbye, Keith. It's sad to see Logan and Ritlock argue. If only there was something to bond them together. <sighs> yes, I know what might help. Keith, I have to leave as well. I fear this meeting was a mistake, but maybe I can fix it. We failed, then. Failed to bring Destiny's Edge back together. We cannot help the others. How can we help Tyria? That's deep. That is deep. Bye bye, Logan. Well, that was fun. What's in the mail? Hello, traveler. Okay. Well, anyways. Hmm. That's kind of like a sad thing that happens every time. Now is where the story becomes less personal and more scripted. Because yes, you have choices of what you're going to do. You can do some things or not, whichever. But basically, 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 you have a 50-50 chance and that your story is going to be sa the same as anybody else who chooses the order, uh, that same order. So yeah. It's probably not exactly that, but yeah. Where am I going? Oh. Pain for pain. Right here. Oh, I'm going to claim this buff, though. This looks like a good one. Claim buff. Nice. It's a good one. Yes, in your instance. Meeting my mentor. Let's go and talk. Uh, speak with my order contact. You know <laughs> what hits the spot right now? A juicy red apple. You're a mysterious apple seller, buddy. Hey there. Can I interest you in an? I don't want an apple. I'm looking for my contact, a member of the or. Yeah. Apples for sale. Nothing but apples to see here, folks. What part of secret society wasn't explained to you? Keep your voice down, Initiate, and pretend you're buying an apple. Sorry. Uh, um, uh, uh, give me that apple. The one over there. My name's Tibbles, Lightbringer of the Order of You-Know-What. It's my job to train you to serve the Order. I'm supposed to figure out if you're trustworthy, and if you are, well, then you get to know more. A lot of people would love to know the secrets our Order collects about the dragons, sometimes for very bad reasons. That makes sense. Put me up to any test, Tybalt. I'll prove myself. Oh boy. First things first. We've got a mission assignment. Are you up for it, Initiate? Uh, aren't you gonna tell me what it is? Ah, not in Lion's Arch. There are ears everywhere. Meet me in Apple Note Hamlet, and I'll brief you there. Um. Okay then. Uh oh. Before oh. you follow Tybalt, speak with me, Initiate. My name is Real, and I am the Order's primary spy in Lion's Arch. The Preceptor sent me to welcome you before you begin your first mission. You have a right to know the dangers you will face. Um. Okay. I have a lightning staff, so. I'm awesome. Welcome, Initiate. Yes, we know who you are. We've been watching you. You join us even as the fate of nations hangs in the balance. Only the Order of Whispers stands between civilization and ruin. In every nation, the dragons are rising. They will devour the world. If they aren't stopped, they'll turn Tyria into a burnt-out husk, a broken shell. Oh no. You may have chosen to join the Order of Whispers, but our trust is earned, not given. Now is the time to show your worth. 
It doesn't matter where the dragons came from or why they awakened. The secrets we discover will help us send them back to hell. Ooh. Welcome to the Order of Whispers. That's deep. This is a long one. So we're gonna do something out in this Hamlet place and then we're gonna be done, I believe. Why the eternal loading screen? Okay, it wasn't that eternal, but whatever. Um, it's not too far. Well, that was an awkward conversation with an apple merchant. Right, I got, I unlocked um, the dungeon, ask, um, AC, Ascalonian Catacombs, so, yeah. I now have access to the worst dungeon in the game. Yes! I am so happy! Not really, because I hate that dungeon. Don't tell anybody I said that. A lot of people love it. <laughs> Crap, I just ruined my life. Don't tell anybody! <sighs> okay. Stealing the Secrets. I love that. I love that. That's an awesome title. Greetings. Who are you? You're Helena? Hey, Initiate. I wish we could have talked at that tavern in Lion's Arch. Free drinks? Plenty of pretty ladies will talk to a broken down engineer. Maybe next time. I'll even buy you a round of something you'll enjoy. Apple cider, right? Ha! Good one. Anyway, here's the situation. This is Crichton. Most of Crichton politics center around a tug of war between the Ministry and the Queen. Minister Cauticus wants to steal the throne from Queen Jenna. Cauticus doesn't see the dragons as a threat. He just wants Crichton for his own. That means we're on the Queen's side, right? You're darn right. Queen Jenna's making a treaty with the Char. She supports Lion's Arch. The Order likes having her in power. Here's where it gets interesting. Minister Cauticus' daughter, to me, contacted the Order of Whispers. Apparently, there's trouble at home. Ooh. To me, Beetlestone is offering detailed information about her father's shady deals in exchange for asylum among the Order. Trouble is, the Order lost contact with the me between Divinity's Reach and Apple Nook Hamlet. Our job is to track her down. Makes sense to me. Let's snoop around and see what we can find. Oh, boy. Hmm. Hello, local. You're staying at the inn? That might bear some investigation. Hmm. It <laughs> well, might. It I should probably read this the parts here. Hmm. Ooh. 
Ministry lads. <laughs> They'll have to hit much harder. them a little and these villagers leak information. So, the me was with friends here, but then disappeared. The Ministry Guard appeared right after she vanished. It makes sense that her father, a powerful minister, sent the Guard to bring her back. But they're still here, which means they haven't found me yet. Hmm. We also know the Ministry Guard commander was angry about a message from an unknown source. Hmm. The Guard has answers we don't have. It's time to know what they know. They're all at the tavern. If we can get them drinking and talking, they'll spill the apples. Let's go. Mr. Apple Merchant. The me disappeared before the Ministry showed up. We need to know more. Hmm. Ministry guards, hmm? This pretty lady will buy you all a drink for some for, for, if you tell me something. <sighs> Hello, sir. You don't want to get into trouble. Um, well, you're nice. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Tension! Stand up straight, Private. You, upstairs, double time. I mean now. Sir, yes sir. Let's follow this bozo and listen in. We might learn something. Ooh. Can we go invisible now, Cammy, Cammy, please? I'm gonna be invisible. Please. What in the name of Balthazar's horned helmet is wrong with you, guardsmen? You're yammering away like a scrit caught red-handed. Ah, uh, we were just talking. No harm done. I never mentioned the commander's letter, or the pirates. Straighten up and call me sir, or you'll find yourself transferred to the Black Hole Mines. Ooh. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Please don't tell the commander, sir. You're lucky the commander's retired to his room, soldier. You'd better do the same before I change my mind on that transfer. Ooh. Jackpot. These guys are no match for professionals. They fall all over themselves. Sounds like the commander has a letter in his room that we need to see. I'll make a distraction. You sneak in while he's busy. Okay. Hmm. Saw some dolgaks out front. Stampedes are always fun. Hmm. Be ready. This could get messy. What in 
Balthazar's breaches. Hey, the bulls are panicking. What in the name of the six gods is going on around here? Something spooked the pack animals, sir. They ran off. Then run them down and bring them back, you idiot. Until our supplies arrive, we'll commandeer what we need I'm from glad the village. You're here. Sergeant, requisition all necessary items from the locals. By force, if necessary. Yes, sir. The top floor. Ah, here's the letter. Oh, interesting. 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 Oh. Oh, what was that? I don't think they're friendly. Defend yourself. Fast and true. Oh, boy. Feel the fury. Why don't you guys go crash? Here we go. Greetings, Commander, blah blah, to me, Beetlestone, in our custody, Ransom. Ransom? Ah, oh, slag iron. And who sent... Ah, oh, here. Cordially yours, Captain Jane of the Jackdaws. To me, has been kidnapped by pirates. Cool. I mean, interesting. That explains why Demi didn't make her meeting with the Order. Does the note say where she's been taken? Of course not. But the jackdaws dock on the far shore of the lake to the north. We should check there. If we disguise ourselves, I bet we can slip right in. If they notice, we'll pass ourselves off as a couple of new hands. I'll scrounge up some jackdaw clothes and meet you there. Hang on, that sounds dangerous. Don't we need to check in with someone before we go further? Does the Order know you're doing this? We operate independently enough for this. The Master of Whispers relies on my discretion. If he trusts me, Initiate, so should you. Okay, then. Oh, that was fun. Um. And I got a Black Lion chest key. Um, we'll go with the speed one. Well, this quest is now over leveled for us, so we'll be back later on to continue on with this but I just bought Skyrim so I'm going to go and I'm going to learn I'm going to play it for like five minutes or something much so yeah see you all later been fun get yourself some hot chocolate and be sure to eat your pie bye